We're going to do mom confessions. And if any of the moms out there want to call and share something with us, we'd love to have it. You don't have to share your name if you don't want to. We have one through email. She did not want to call, but she said, Dear Bobby, I'd feel much better if I told you this via email. I used my eight-year-old son's toothbrush to clean mud off, and I really got in the grooves of my running shoes. My plan was to replace the toothbrush with a new one because I already have one in the bathroom, and I really meant to. Well, I sat it down and forgot to replace it in that exact moment, and my son ended up using it. I couldn't bring myself to tell him. (laughs) But he did use it a couple times, but I did replace it ASAP. (laughs) This is my mom confession. Please forgive me for my sins. (laughs) You know what? I do forgive you. Thank you for sharing with us. I bet you there are so many things like this that are happening every single day that moms are, are, are going through, that moms are doing. Then if you just need to get it off your chest, our number is 877-77-BOBBY. That's the situation. Amy, anything you'd like to admit to? Well, I mean, something recently was that in a bowl of cereal, and I was like, I think that this is this is a hair, and it was like this really big deal. I said, okay, fine, I'll go make you another bowl. Oh, there was no other bowl made. So I went to the kitchen and I just pulled out the hair and I sprinkled a little bit more cereal. On no it. other bowl was made. But to me, there was no point in wasting a bunch of cereal when I knew it was just my hair. Okay, uh, waiter confession. We used to do that back in the day when I waited tables. They'd be like, yeah, there's something's wrong here. Okay, you just go back. You just turn the meat a little bit. Oh, my gosh. Uh, oh, my gosh. That's terrible. The there was it. nothing wrong with it. Sometimes people were just out of control with their demands. One of my steak in this shape. I thought I was getting it. Okay. It's not cooked well enough. You know what you do? You go out. You put it in the oven for 30 seconds. Just reheat it again. Okay. The chef has, oh, it's perfect now. Yeah. We didn't do anything to it. <laughs> yeah, no details. It's that's perfect. Awesome. That's happened all the time. <laughs> Love it. Eddie, anything? You're not a mom. Mm-hmm. But you are a dad of four. If you look deep into the arsenal, deep into the well, mm-hmm. is there anything you'd like to admit to, or is you pretty much just a perfect dad? No, look, I don't want this to be a, a common theme, but I don't have a lot of cash on me. I really don't. And so when I need cash, mm-hmm. I know where to get it immediately. My kids keep their wallets in the same place. And so I borrowed recently $20 from one of my boys, and I still haven't paid it back. And he's mentioned it, like, I swear I had, but his- mem- Oh, he doesn't even know you borrowed it. No, no, tell him? No, no, guys, I will, I will put it back. It. I will put it back. That's not borrowing. This is but, why but it's a confession. That's my, a heist. You this, just pulled off a heist. This kid, he, his memory's not great, so he's thinking, he like, he must have lost it somewhere, and I haven't said anything about he's it. He's in trouble for forgetting where he put his money. <laughs> so that's not good. It's a Bobby Bones show.